Hi there, I'm Mike, and what I have for you today is a video I haven't done in a while, and it's been so long. I have two Geek Fuels to do, and I don't remember which one is which, so I'm just gonna do them both, because um, I didn't do anything in June, and I got both of these in the month of June. I think one of these is for May, and the other one is for June, which means that Geek Fuel is caught up, I suppose. Um, but I'm not I'm not going through the motions of putting them in a box. I I used to be I used to put on like a big theatrical show. I don't know. I just don't feel like it. I took a month off and now I'm I'm back and I'm just I'm streamlining stuff. So let's just get into these bags. And that's what they are. It's not unboxings, it's unbaggings. Uh I don't know which one came first. I I it's like a chicken and egg thing. It doesn't doesn't really matter. But uh, I guess let's just start with the one and open it up. And I'm going to try something. And if it doesn't work, it's just going to look stupid. And we're going to go with it, okay? But um, let's give it a shot. Well, I don't know if that looked any good. We'll find out. Uh, but this is what's in the contents of the bag. Now, things are just falling out. Uh, we get a shirt. We get a $5 coupon for things in the store or more boxes and I got a uh, a little a little pin here I feel like I should have gotten something else but nope okay that's all I got there is a there's some stuff on here you can scan there's a chance to win I guess like a Harry Potter theme in this one there's a chance to win a little Snape thing and uh, there's some stuff you can go on the store there's like a model kit that you can buy and a Q pal plush and some socks. I'm glad that I don't have some of those, honestly. But what we do have here is a shirt and this is the shirt box. This is why you get it. And to be honest, for the most part, that was the thing that kind of got me to continue to get Geek Fuels anyway. But I will say, I, I kind of miss the old box, like the classic boxes. You got a pin pal, which was great, a cool shirt, some like random thing, a game. You know, they used to give like Steam games out and stuff. It was like a whole thing. It was a lot of fun, but uh, you know, the world's changed. Everything's kind of gone to crap. But uh, what I have here is a Mount Greylock shirt school of witchcraft and wizard. I have no idea. I've read every Harry Potter book. I've seen every Harry Potter movie, including the terrible, the terrible ones, you know, the ones, most of them, but, um, I don't know what Mount Greylock is. Should I? Is that a thing? Am I missing this? Let me know. Cause I'm super curious now, but, uh, let's replace my really awesome shirt with this Mount Greylock shirt. Sounds like a He-Man thing, but I know it's not. By the power of Greylock. Nope, that's not it. Anyways, let's give it a shot. One, two, three. Oh, okay. All right. So it's a... It's a shirt. It's a, it's a shirt that I can wear. Um, again, I just, I don't really, I don't get it. Admittedly, I'm not the biggest Harry Potter fan, but I have been to Edinburgh where a lot of Harry Potter stuff was kind of invented, I guess, or thought of. Tom Riddle's grave's there. Um, the coffee house that she wrote the first book in is there. So I've seen that. That makes me some kind of Harry Potter fan, I guess. But it was mostly my wife that wanted to see that stuff. She dragged me through a graveyard at like 11.30 at night. That was scary. Anyways, uh, so this is the shirt I've got. Now, you also do get a pin here. Uh, if that's your thing, this is a Miss Marvel, a Captain Marvel pen, not a Miss Marvel pen. Although I have to say, I am enjoying the pants off of, nope, I, I don't think she's, I can't say that, that sounds weird. I am thoroughly enjoying Miss Marvel. <laughs> it's a fun show. Uh, even though I'm definitely not the demographic for it, I'm enjoying it anyway. But I also, I also enjoy Captain Marvel, so, uh, that's fine. It's a nice pin, I think it's a Mondo pin, so it's a classy pin. Mondo Good stuff right there. Mondo's some good stuff. And again, you get this pin, you get this shirt, which is a $10, no, $10 here, 
20, $25 value here. Plus you get, you get a $5, just $5 of, this one's good until 1031. Um, so you get $5 that you can use towards the store or more geek fuels and, and whatnot. I think I've saved up enough to basically get a free, I should use those before they expire. Anyways, uh, let me know <laughs> what you thought of this. I thought it was fine. For the 20 bucks or whatever this cost, uh, that's like the price of the shirt. Although it's not, it's not my favorite shirt, admittedly. It's a shirt I don't really understand. Uh, and the pin's neat, but I don't really do anything with pins. Although I used to say, oh, I don't collect pins and, and I have a huge pin collection now. So that's technically not true. I just don't purposefully collect pins, I guess. But that's just one of the two boxes. So let's go ahead and pop the open the open one up. The other one open is what I meant to say. So let's uh, let's try that thing again that I did. So Okay, I mean I, I, maybe that worked better, maybe it didn't. Maybe it looked equally as stupid both ways. I don't know, but this shirt is all about Jurassic, well this, not shirt, this bag is all about Jurassic Park. We got, uh, looks like a Jurassic Park shirt and a uh, trading card bonus maybe? And you know, this is the same kind of deal as before. You get, you get a shirt, you get like one other thing, uh, and then you get a, a, a $5 card, which again is good until the 31st of October. So that's kind of weird because that's like the same as the other one. Either way, doesn't matter. We get, oh, we get a nice trading card in this one. Check that out. Chaos Theory. That's a, that's some sexy gold blooming right there. We get uh, a Wizard of Oz pin. I don't think this is part of the theme. It's another Mondo pin. So it's a, it's a licensed Mondo pin. This one's um, Dorothy, I guess. I used to live in Kansas, you know. Not that, not that that matters or relates to anything here, but it's a, it's a true fact about me. Uh, <laughs> let's let's see if this shirt. Oh, is it a? Is it, no, okay. I thought it was a long sleeve shirt for a second here. Let's uh let's try this shirt on because I do love me some Jurassic Park. And on the day I'm recording this, it is July sixth. So you know, happy July sixth Park to the people that celebrate out there. Let's give it a shot. What? Two, three. Hoo. Oh, okay. All right. All right. This one's, this was pretty good. I like this one because it's something that I, I get, I guess. We got, uh, we got some amber up here. No, up here on this side. I'm looking at the camera behind my camera, which is just my phone. Um, we have some dinosaurs on here. We got so we got a Hammond down there. I just, I just saw finally the new Jurassic Park Dominion um, with my dad a couple weeks ago. It was fine. It was fine. I didn't hate it. I didn't think of, I didn't feel like I wasted my money or time, but I, I probably won't go see it again. But I enjoyed what I, I enjoyed it just fine. It's, it's not my favorite movie. Anyways, but I do, I do love Jurassic Park. Jurassic Park stands the test of time, even from 1993 till now. It doesn't need a special edition. You don't need to redo any effects. It is great, exactly how it is. I enjoy having shirts of it because this is, what I love about this doesn't hit you over the head. It's not like it's a big Jurassic Park logo. You look at it, you get it, you say, cool shirt, you move on with your life. Exactly how a shirt should be. Uh, but yeah, and again, you get another one of these uh, $5 gift cards, which you can use towards some merch in the store, which uh, looks like you can get a Barbasol can and or a little uh, Mondoid, a little ball thing was like a dinosaur or again, some socks, if that's your thing or uh, an enamel pin that's limited to 300. Wow, it'd have been really cool to maybe get one of those, but um, nope. And if you uh, scan this QR code, you can get entered to win a, a looks like a, a Jurassic Park Lego set, which is neat. It's neat. But uh, yeah, again, I like the shirt and this is this, each of these is like 20 bucks a pop. So just, it's not, it's not the end of the world, but I get, I get if you're like, well, I used to get Geek Fuels 
and they had a lot more in them in the past and now you just get a t-shirt and a box it's going to turn a lot of people off it turned me off at first i'm going to continue to get this so that i still have something to unbox on my channel because i feel like unboxings are still a thing that people some people will watch my channel for i don't do as many as i used to but i do feel like there was a point where i was doing too many unboxings and not enough other stuff uh and and i'm trying to swing it the other way but instead i just kind of did nothing for a month but sometimes people just need a break you know i'm back i'm back and unboxing these so also i, I have to do unboxings for my unboxing set on patreon the people that support me at the unboxing level they're they're here here and they're they're great they're all fantastic people love every person on this list uh and and everyone that just supports me on patreon in general but for this video specifically these people because they support me for my unboxings or at a level that i just thank them for everything because they just support me at that level that's how the patreon thing works anyways let me know down the downstairs area what'd you think of this did you like the shirts did you like the pins um again we got a we got a captain marvel and then we got a we got a we got a, a dorothy is that how is that how they say it it's kind of like like from the 40s they had that weird transatlantic accent which was an accent that didn't actually exist except for in movies which is weird uh and then you know i've got 10 bucks i've got 10 dollars that i can that's like half the cost of one of these two bags that i got back in money that i can then spend again with them it's kind of like dave and busters where you go spend money to get money you can only spend at dave and busters uh but you know stuff i like so there's that let me know down in the downstairs area what you thought also i'd love it if you could just like share subscribe all that stuff goes a long way to helping out the channel and again thanks to the people here that support me on patreon at an unboxing level or higher it was super nice if you guys do that and with that i'll see you later thanks for watching thanks for getting this far and again, I'll see, I said that, but I'll, I'll see you later. Bye.